that it is almost May, we are, we wanted to start talking about a cleanse. Um, one, I feel like summer, we're just coming out of, it's not even spring. I don't know what we're doing right now. We're coming out of winter, I feel like. Um, the sun is starting to come up. It's starting to get lighter earlier. I like to do a cleanse every quarter, every three months especially if I have something systemic going on. So I had suffered from eczema um, my uh, adult life, most of my adult life. And the doctors just told me, um, they put me on really heavy prescriptions. They put me on prednisone. They gave me topical ointments. It was all reactionary. And at that time in my life, I didn't know that it could be um, prevented at the root cause of the problem. I didn't know to even think I mean, really, why it was happening in the first place. Um, And as I did my research, I realized like I had become allergic to things and I didn't understand why I'd become allergic to things because I've never been allergic to things in the past. And as my research went on and later on, I got into doTERRA, I started to get some answers just about this toxic environment that my body was trying to, to save me from. And I started doing doTERRA's 30-day cleanses kind of on a regular basis, every quarter, like I said. As I do more and more research, you can do a 30-day cleanse or use the products that we're going to talk about tonight in back to back to back if you have things that are serious autoimmune disease or things that you've been dealing with for a really long time. um, A lot of times we have abused our body, our elimination organs more than we realize or more than we thought. And um, we have to cleanse those out. Sometimes it takes more than just a 30 days. And you'll see that this gets broken down into 10 day in- increments. And, um, and sometimes we just need to be a little bit more aggressive. We like to start slow. So in May, we're going to tell you about these products. We're going to answer a lot of questions. We're going to start planting those seeds of let's get ready for summer. Let's have a glowing, healthy, beautiful skin. And, um, and let's start to make some switches in our head about the products that we may be using or things that are getting into our system that we didn't even know about. So this picture right here that you're seeing is doTERRA's wellness lifestyle pyramid. And, um, and by the way, I can't always see when people jump on. So if you jump on live, feel free to, to say hello um, and to ask any questions at any time. And if you're watching this later and you have questions, go ahead and just private message me or certainly tag me in it because otherwise I might not see it. Um, but I want to talk about developing a lifestyle of wellness that implements healthy habits. And tonight we're going to talk about two main ways, two main areas lifestyle and health care. So when we combine proper nutrition and exercise and rest and stress management, and we kind of fluctuate through all of those as we're educating on, on living a healthier lifestyle, reducing toxic load. Um, many people don't know that that compromises our lifestyle. And, a, and, and when we can, um, when we can work on that, it helps to boost us up into better health, maximum health which is what we're looking for. Each aspect of this pyramid builds on the others. And if any piece is left out, we kind of get compromised. So our focus today is going to be on that toxic load because we're going to have to talk about why would we do a cleanse? So a toxin is anything that causes the body harm. A toxic load refers to the accumulation of all the toxins that affect your body at any given time and the burden that it places on the body systems and on your organs. So I'm looking at these three pictures here, the pathogens, the chemicals, and the radiation. So toxins come from many sources. Um, In fact, the world around us is saturated with toxins, many of which we don't even know. Pathogens, chemicals, radiation are three of the most common categories of toxins. Pathogens are microbial agents such as bacteria or funguses or viruses that invade the body and they cause infection or disease. Chemicals are natural or synthetic substances that cause harm to the body. Common examples are processed foods, artificial sweeteners, flavor enhancers, automobile exhaust, cigarette smoke, solvents, plastic pesticides, xenoestrogens, and harsh cleaning products. Radiation. Um, refers to high energy particles that can cause harm to cellular structures and DNA. And the most common source of radiation is sunlight. Not sunlight, no. And our body does a really good job when we're young because it's nice and clean and shiny, like a shiny engine, like everything is not clogged up and working perfectly. 
And although your body deals with toxins in a number of ways, the three most vulnerable areas of exposure are one, the lungs, two, the digestive tract, and three, the skin due to more direct exposure. Toxins can be ingested through the food that we eat, inhaled in the air that we breathe, or absorbed transdermally when something is applied topically or contacts the skin. So each of these avenues has physiologic defense mechanisms to minimize a toxic exposure. What does that mean? It's how the body protects itself um, involves the lungs. They're very delicate tissue that can be affected by germs or smoke or dust and other harmful substances that we breathe. To protect this tissue, the nose, the mouth, and the throat are lined with a thick mucous membrane to trap foreign particles. Special immune cells also are present within the lung tissue to destroy anything that may be getting past those mucous membranes. So our first area is in reducing toxic load by avoiding toxic exposure in the first place. So a little common sense goes a long way, but utilizing protective barriers such as gloves or masks or creating proper ventilation goes a long way. So um, you can also use essential oils as partners of prevention. Essential oils have been demonstrated to positively affect our environment. Diffusing them in the home or work is a preventative measure made to help maintain cleaner air. Washing your produce with a little lemon oil or even our on-guard concentrate, vinegar and baking soda is a simple, effective method. Le sorry, lemon, vinegar, and baking soda together or our on-guard concentrate. It reduces those harmful contaminants that are on your fruit and vegetables before they get into your family and into your system. Our second area of focus is reducing toxic load is supporting the defense functions. So we're gonna take a look at some specific supplements and essential oils that provide the best organ support. And the body needs energy to conduct its own best efforts um, of protection and detoxification, and it uses nutrients to produce and create this capacity. So many of the toxins today are fat soluble and the liver in particular needs support as its function is paramount to success as it plays a significant role in eliminating fat soluble toxins. Another form of toxicity is the presence of free radicals that cause oxidation, which if not handled, causes damage and premature breakdown of cells. Antioxidants are imperative for the elimination of free radicals and at the root of all toxic conditions in the body is an inflamed and irritated cell membrane. It's our best interest to prevent this inflammation. So how can we provide support and nourishment to our defense mechanisms? Many of you have already heard about and or are taking our lifelong vitality vitamins. Um, they are the foundation of wellness. They've got your essential nutrients, the vitamins, the minerals, the whole food extract, the antioxidants, the fatty acid, the essential oils that are vital and must be consumed in adequate levels. These are specifically designed to support the typical adult diet and correct deficiencies. So combined with a healthy diet, they provide a sound foundation that supports both the structure and healthy function of the body. Again, it's through nourishment in the body that will the body will perform at its best. So nutrients such as those and on Microplex BMZ supply the body with resources to produce energy. The ingredients in the Alpha CRS are superb, superb antioxidant resources, as well as supportive of optimal liver function. And the XC Omega is a high quality source of omega-3, 6, and 9 necessary for the body to mitigate the inflammatory response. The Lifelong Vitality Trio is perfect to nourish and fortify the body's own defense mechanisms, and they are meant to work together. So our third area of focus is to reduce toxic load and it's managing, expo and managing exposure by optimizing elimination. This is where people don't normally hear, have not heard about this. So our body's complex and it's a system of detoxification complete with organs and the processes that allow elimination of any toxins that may enter the body. The liver, the kidney, and the colon are involved in this, in our body's natural detoxification process, just as our skin, our lungs, and our G GI tract are. It's important to take measures to support these organs. So let's talk about the elimination pathways. I like to call them the primary chimneys of elimination. How does that stuff get out of your body? Your primary chimneys are your intestinal tract and your urinary system. Those are the ways that toxins are, your body's gonna wanna rid itself of toxins first and foremost. 
Secondary chimneys are respiratory system and the skin. So by the time our skin starts to erupt, it is an indicator to me that my primary chimneys are not cleaned out. And that's when I need to really focus on doing a cleanse. Um, does that make sense? We wanna support optimal elimination. So we wanna make sure that those chimneys are functioning, proper flow of intestinal tract, proper flow of our urinary tract, pop proper liver function, and it prevents overuse of secondary chimneys. So we don't get those skin eruptions. So keep in mind that because our first focus is to ensure we have the proper flow of both that intestinal and urinary tract, as well as lifting any unnecessary burdens from the other chimneys of the body so that they won't overexpress once we increase the process of detoxification. So how can we do this? How can we not overexpress once we increase the process of detoxification. We're going to promote proper elimination. So these are two more of the products. So we talked about lemon already. We talked about briefly, and we talked about our um, lifelong vitality vitamins. The next two um, supplements are the Zendocrine Complex and Terrazine. So we're going to look at each of these and how they play a role in supporting those chimneys and getting that job done. The main function of the body's GI tract is to metabolize the food that we eat and excrete waste products. It also plays a major role in absorption. So unfortunately for many people, the system tends to be experiencing less than optimal function. The body must be able to distinguish usable substances from harmful toxins and to accomplish this to accomplish this differentiation, the GI tract serves as a selective barrier that strictly regulates absorption and prevents toxins from entering the bloodstream and the lymph systems. The intestines are the body's main site of absorption. So vitamins, minerals, fats, proteins, carbohydrates, those are all absorbed in the small intestine. And the large intestine is responsible for absorbing excess water from waste products and handling indigestible substances such as fiber. So to maximize absorption, the intestinal walls are lined with hair-like projections that dramatically increase the surface area available for absorption. If the intestines were to be laid out, their surface would be equi equivalent to that of a whole tennis court. So diving a little bit deeper into the GI tract, when food and nutrients are absorbed, they pass through the walls of the digestive system and directly into the bloodstream for systemic delivery throughout the body. It's important for the intestinal walls to maintain both efficient yet selective absorption. This allows the body to absorb the nutrients it needs for health while also preventing toxins from entering the body. The walls of the intestines are made up of specialized epithelial cells that serve as a selective barrier that allow only certain substances to pass circulation into circulation. Covering the walls of the intestines are millions of little teeny hair structures called villi that extend into the intestinal tubes. Smaller still are microvilli that cover the villi. Combine these three structures dramatically increases the surface area available for absorption and give the intestines extraordinarily efficient yet highly selective absorption capabilities. You might have learned that back in science class and it's been a long time for some of us, right? So an important product with significant benefits to the GI tract is Terrazyme. That is our digestive enzyme complex. And this product contains a unique blend of active whole food enzymes and mineral cofactors that are really deficient, that are just deficient in food that is processed, preservative laden, or cooked. The ingredients in Terrazyme di aid digestion and support and overall health of the GI tract. Um, we made some um, adjustments to it. Um, let's see. Let's just explain how digestive enzymes work. So enzymes are a special substance that help catalyze biochemical reactions in the body. So they're crucial players in the physiologic processes, including metabolism and detoxification. Fresh raw foods naturally contain sufficient enzymes for proper digestion in the body, but when food is cooked or processed, these naturally occurring food enzymes can be destroyed. 
pasteurization or sterilizing or radiation or preserve it, pr preservation, freezing, microwaving, all of our modern food supply can render food enzymes inactive or alter their structure so much that they become useless to the body. Food processing can also remove important vitamins and mineral cofactors of enzymatic chemistry into the body. So we can reduce the internal demand for production of digestive enzymes by increasing the amount of fresh raw foods in our diets. Some people suggest a healthy diet would include at least 60% food nutrients coming from fresh raw foods, but it's not always available. I thought I was only gonna take Terrazyme when I didn't have fresh fruits or vegetables on my plate. And that was almost like, and the things weren't cooked or processed. That was actually rare, more rare than I thought. So um, Terrazyme is in our 30 day cleanse because um, it's especially important to begin with it in the first 10 days. We have a calendar to show you which days you're using which products prior to the introduction of the other components to ensure that that flow of the GI tract or in other words, the proper flow and function of this important primary chimney is working. It's recommended to use one to three capsules with each meal every day. It's also very effective when taken on an empty stomach to pursue old waste in various areas of the body. So basically if you take it in the morning before on an empty stomach, it goes in and it helps really move through that food that hasn't gotten digested yet in your, in your system, ew. Terrazyme is highly recommended as an important first step in the detoxification process. So you definitely want to have Terrazyme and you can buy this as a whole kit, you guys, or you can piece it together because some people have parts of this and some people don't have any of it. So there is a discounted kit and you save money when you buy it. It's called the Cleanse and Restore Kit. And then, um, and then like me, I actually had everything because you're not going to use all of, um, some of the bottles and so I have some left over from the last kit so like the Zendocrine and the Zendocrines both of them and the um, GX Assist you only use 10 of those um okay whoops let's go back here so let's talk about how a toxin goes into your liver and how it gets eliminated so many organs of the body have powerful detoxification functions particularly the liver the kidneys and the colon Supporting these organs is really important for maintaining optimal detoxification functions and keeping the bodies clear of toxins. The liver is the metabolic powerhouse responsible for processing the fats, the proteins, the carbohydrates, and other nutrients into forms that are easier to use by the rest of the body. And it also plays a key role in detoxifying the body of drugs or toxins. So after metabolism in the liver, any waste products must be eliminated. Solid waste is removed to the colon in the form of feces, while nitrogenous, I don't know how to pronounce that, nitrogenous waste is eliminated through the kidneys as urea. Notice the liver does not have its own outside chimney and it is reliant on two primary chimneys. If either of these two chimneys are unable to partner sufficiently with the liver, it will find additional exit points for its waste products, namely the skin, resulting in skin eruptions. So think of acne, think of maybe rosacea, think of um, eczema, think of anything that comes out in your skin. There's many, many of them. So that's really interesting and a point that I often forget that the liver doesn't have its, its own process there and it has to use the kidneys or the colon or the skin. So we're now going to talk about the Zendocrine complex. And I know this is a little bit complicated because doTERRA puts it under an umbrella of the Zendocrine family. And so we're thinking cleansing of the organs, but we have two different ones. We have one called a complex and one called um, well, Zendocrine oil or um, capsule. This one is the complex and this is more... Um, I want to say this one has more herbs in it. Let's see. One is the complex is like the janitor that cleans things up. And the Zendocrine oil is like the repair man that repairs it after you're cleaning things up. So they do two work differently. I have people that are on the Zendocrine oil like always. They just love how it makes them feel and they love that repairing function. But let's talk about how Zendocrine complex um, works. As part of the body functions of eating, breathing, and coming into contact with other environment, with our environment through our skin, our bodies are exposed to numerous toxins and microbial pathogens. 
One of the primary functions of vital organs is to act as a protective filter against these agents. The largest organ, the skin, has a primary protective function against toxic exposure and infection. The lungs help filter the air we breathe from particulates and pollutants. The GI tract from the stomach to the colon of the large intestine are also, also perform significant cleansing and filtering of toxins. If toxins make it past these organs on the first line of defense, other organs such as the kidneys and liver perform additional filtering functions to rid our bodies of chemicals and pathogens that can cause us harm. So the body's filtering and waste management system is quite capable of managing a certain amount of exposure to toxic influences. But a modern world of environmental pollutants and harmful chemicals found in our preserved food, our prepared food, beauty products, treated water, etc., the body's filtering systems can become significantly challenged. Just as the filter in a car, a furnace, or a coffee machine can plug up over time, your body's filtering organs can also become plugged with toxins. Healthy organs have the capacity to clean or unplug themselves under normal conditions, but as we get older and under suboptimal health conditions, the liver, the kidneys, the colon, the lungs, and the skin can result from suboptimal health conditions of those things can result from overexposure and buildup of toxicity in the vital organs. So supporting healthy cleansing and filtering functions of these organs begin by limiting exposure to environmental toxins that we breathe or touch and by eliminating foods that have artificial chemicals or that have been treated with pesticides or other chemicals. Drinking a lot of water is also essential for healthy function of our cleansing organs. And additionally, supplementing our healthy diets with nutrients that provide targeted support for specific organs can support healthy cleansing and filtering functions of the body. So when it comes to detox, liver is the king because it participates in so many metabolic and detoxification pathways. It is important to keep this organ really healthy. There are multiple products that we're going to talk about and essential oils that provide really, really good support to the liver as well as the other detoxification organs. So here's the Zendocrine oil blend. We call it the supplement. It comes in an oil, just a blend, and it also comes in capsules so that you can just swallow it. And in there is tangerine, juniper berry, cilantro, geranium, and rosemary. They are, this key is um, maximize, is maximized for the health of the liver, the kidneys, the colon, and the endocrine system. So, um, again, that is a different, in different ingredients than the Zendocrine complex. Each essential oil included in this blend has a detoxification property known to support the function and health of the liver and the kidneys. The three main formulation changes. Oh, they just changed a couple of things up. You don't even need to know about that. Okay, and now the next product, and this one is like, this one, we start on day 10. We want to prep the body for 10 days. We want to make sure we're doing that terrazyme, we're cleansing things out so that when things start to, I'm just going to say die off with these hot, hot oils that make, that make it an uncomfortable environment for anything that's not supposed to be in your body to be in your body, is this GX Assist, Okay. I think of it like gut X assist. Um, this currently is out of stock. It's coming back in May, but I talked to um, corporate about it. I'm like, hey, we're doing a 30 day cleanse. Like we need this product. If you don't have this one on hand, you can buy it in the kit, 30 day cleanse kit. It's still in that kit or you could just buy these oils or maybe you have them and you could put them in a capsule. Um, it does have caprylic acid in there. So you're not getting those. If you, you're not getting caprylic acid, you can get that separately if you wanted to, not from doTERRA. Um, or you could just put these oils in a capsule and take it. So let me know if you have big concerns about that. We will work with you and try to figure out if you can't get it by the day 10. Now, when I say a soft cleanse in the May, right, you could just do the other pathways of elimination, especially if you know, like, I got a lot of stuff going on. Start with the vitamins, start with the citrus oils in your water, start with the terrazyme, start with the zendocrine, and maybe we don't do GX Assist until June. Or 
I'm going to try to do it two months in a row just to make sure that my um, pathways of elimination are clean because it has been a while since I did this. It's probably been a year since I did a cleanse like correctly. So GX Assist is the next cleansing partner. It combines the blend that I just talked to you about and it demonstrates, it's cl clinically demonstrated detoxification, has clinically demonstrated detoxification properties. Because of its lipophilic structure, it is able to easily penetrate cellular membranes of hostile organite organisms and eliminate them. Let me read that again. This is when, when you guys hear me say uh, essential oils have a unique pathway. They have a unique pathway that other products can't penetrate your cells like this. So it can easily penetrate cellular membranes of hostile organisms and eliminate them. GX Assist contains 195 milligrams of essential oils, including oregano, tea tree, lemon, lemongrass, peppermint, and thyme. And the chemistry of these oils includes a variety of phenol, alcohol, and aldehyde type constitutes that synergistically provide complete detoxification properties. The unique formulation of this product provides powerful ingredients for purifying and cleansing the digestive system. It's recommended to take one to three soft gels with meals the second 10 days of your 30 day cleanse. This one's awesome. It's harsh. All of those are harsh, like hot oils and make it very unhabitable for anything that's not supposed to be in your system. I love this product. Many toxins are fat solubu soluble, so the body has to deal with these toxins and the liver plays a major role. Often there is an excessive amount of toxins to deal with and as a part of the body's natural immune response, these toxins are moved to fatty tissue in an effort to protect critical organs. Storing toxins in this way is a protective measure that dilutes toxins and prevents them from causing harm to other areas of the body. And when this occurs, it's more difficult to lose fat because the bot, because of the role it plays in the immune function. So as a result, it makes sense for your fat cells to do a detox as well. A lot of people do see a weight loss when they do the 30 day cleanse. Some don't, some do. Depends on what's stored in your fat cells, I guess. And our final area of focus is the GI tract. The main function of the body's gastrointestinal tract is to metabolize the food we eat and excrete waste products. However, Many people don't know that the GI tract and the immune system are also they're linked. Because of its major role in absorption, much of the body's immune function also occurs in the GI tract. The body must be able to distinguish usable substances from harmful toxins, and to accomplish this differentiation, the GI tract serves as a selective barrier that strictly regulates absorption and prevents toxins from entering the bloodstream. Within the stomach is gastric acid, a digestive fluid containing hydrochloric acid. This fluid is highly acidic with a pH of 1.3, and that's comparable to the acid of acidity of battery acid. Besides playing a key role in digestion, gastric acid also plays import, is important for the body's immune system. This fluid is so powerful that it's capable of killing most toxic microbes that have inappropriately entered the digestive tract. In walks our PB assist. This is our probiotic. So, some of you, like me, have our old PB, it's called PB assist. The new kits are going to come with PB restore. It is, and they have added benefits to the PB assist, but I'm going to use up my PB, the PB assist that I already have before I purchase the PB restore. I'm really excited about the PB restore, and I'm almost done with my PB assist that I had on hand. This one is really, really great. I want the upgrade as soon as I use this. So our probiotic has a probiotic and a prebiotic. Um, it's a blend and they probiotics are living organics such as bacteria that live in the gastrointestinal tract and are known to provide health benefits. Prebiotics are indigestible substances such as fiber or something I can't pronounce, oligosaccharides that foster an optimal environment for microbial colonization and stimulate microbial activity in the gut. So if we just killed everything, right, that was supposed to be there with the GX Assist, now we wanna make sure that with that room that's now been vacated, we wanna repopulate that with as much good biotics as we can. 
So it employs a unique double air capsule delivery system that provides both short chain prebiotic fiber in the outer capsule and a time release inner capsule with active probiotic cultures. This unique delivery system allows probiotics to be released into the intestines where they'll have the maximum benefit and not damaged by that hard, harsh acidic environment of the stomach that we just talked about. The combination of pre and pro cultures in a time release single delivery system makes this product really unique. It's like green, it looks kind of space age. Um, just talking about our blend there, a little bit more about that. And then I think this is the last product is our DDR Prime. And that is an essential oil blend of frankincense, wild orange, lemongrass, thyme, summer savory, clove, and neoli. DDR Prime helps support cellular immunity and cellular health, promotes a healthy response to free radicals. Exclusive combination of essential oils offers unparalleled support of the body's natural free radical defense systems. And the soft gels or the oil, but the soft gels make it easy to get your daily serving of free radical fighting essential oils for optimal well-being. I also, DDR Prime doesn't taste lovely in your mouth, so I do like it in a capsule. So this is kind of the system here, you guys. We've got the vitamins all 30 days. And then we do the Terrazyme, the Zendocrine, and the Zendocrine Complex for the first 10 days. Then we stop the Zendocrine oil and we start the GX Assist for 10 days. Then we stop that one and we start the PB Assist and DDR Prime. Not too difficult. We have a chart that we are going to um, send to those people that are interested in doing um, kind of a walkthrough cleanse with us. So all throughout this month, we're going to be sharing on the Essential Ninja Dojo page. That's our education page. Just um, more tips and tricks, healthy living, and those kind of things, answering any questions about starting a cleanse, doing a cleanse, how do we get prepped for it? And then June 1st, um, we will start the, it's just easier to start on the first of the month. We're gonna do like daily tips and trips, daily lives, um, prizes for those people who are doing it with us hardcore that are sticking with it. It's kind of fun. I mean, I do it just because it helps me stay on track and I like having fun and doing it with other people, but I actually want to shed just a couple last pounds from COVID. And so I really need that push to do a little bit extra in June to make sure that um, I'm just committed to a healthy lifestyle. And I hope people want to do that with me. So this is the cleanse and restore kit. You can put that on your LRP if you already have an account with us. If you are watching this, somebody sent this to you and you want to start with the Cleanse and Restore Kit, um, that would be awesome to do. Sometimes we have a um, um, an incentive, like when you just start, you get to, or, or, or if you're starting in a particular month, there's a um, some freebies, so watch out for them. It'll always ask you like who invited you, who introduced you to this video. So someone on our team, um, whoever introduced you, make sure that their name is on there so that they can be your support person. And then we'll add you into whatever way you wanna follow up when continuing education. We do weekly classes. Um, we're always here to support you. We do deep dives sometimes if you have a particular issue or interest. And those are always fun depending on season or really what people are just looking for. So um, reach out to us or comment here below if you can, um, if you're interested in joining that 30 day cleanse, we're going to have a link very shortly to put up so people can start registering. And I make just to make sure I don't miss anybody getting them into that Facebook page. So thanks for joining us. If you're watching this now or later, again, we are um, the Essential Ninja team. We have a lot of amazing people that help us um, and stay on track with a healthy lifestyle. And we're glad that you joined us.